Okay guys, today I'm going to walk you through preventing a form of duplicate content. Now you might be thinking, I don't have duplicate content, there's nothing to worry about. I can assure you that this is something you should consider. Also in terms of um, page rank, this will improve your page rank. Now as you're aware, I'm just going to write this on the screen for you so you can see more clearly. We have two different types of indexing. Google and other search engines will index both versions. So we might have www.yoursite.com and we also have the straight HTTP yoursite.com. Both will work in browsers. However, Google might find this version and index it. Now through linkbacks it might find this version and see both as competing as separate websites. How do we, we prevent this? Well, we use this little bit of code here. I will copy and paste it on, on the um, page so you can just highlight and whip it in and, and uh, get cracking straight away because I do want you to use this on your own site as soon as possible. It is quite important that you sort this out. Not many sites are aware that this issue exists so what's happening? Google will view both versions of your website and penalize possibly one or both of the sites for having duplicate, duplicate or mirror content. It will also affect your page rank. So you can imagine if you have one, um, one high PR site, so say we've got a PR of 7 pointing to this site and then we have a PR of 7 pointing to this site. Now that might increase your PR, bring your PR to say 4 or 5. And again it might bring your PR to 4 or 5. However, if we have both pointing to this website, this version of your site, What's your PR going to be? It's going to be a 6 or a 7. Okay, I hope that's enough incentive for you to take action on this and make the changes that you need right now. Okay, so this is the code we need. The bit that matters to you is this little bit. So as you can see here, I've used one of my websites, getmoresales.info, and again, we've put get more sales info here and what this is doing is making sure that no matter what what is linking to our site or how a search engine finds our site we will always serve up the www version of your site straightforward stuff okay so copy and paste this into notepad we want to save it as a .ht access so we go dot ht access yep okay and now we head over to our FTP software and here you can see we have our dot ht access file this is the um, public directory there's not a lot on this site at the moment so I'm just going to upload and there we can see it on the server. Okay, I hope you've enjoyed this little tutorial. Um, do take action. If you want to know some more uh, tips and tri tricks like this which will undoubtedly help your website and generate more sales, do check out my course. It's available at getmoresales.info and I will see you next time.